Sunday here on the east coast of the United States and it's about um, quarter of nine Sunday morning. I'm here with the project share. This is for a swap and it's going in the mail to tomorrow probably overnight because it has to be there by the 20th and if I mail it on the 18th that's only two days. So I'm gonna have to send it overnight cat and this is run by uh, the, the host is, excuse me, Perfectly Imperfect Crafts, who is Kat, K-A-T, I think short for Kathy, I don't know. Anyway, I know her as Kat. Uh, she and Jan's Crazy Life got together um, and um, I decided to do this patchwork embellishment swap, embellishment box swap. And you could do one or two. Unfortunately, Kat, I only had time to do one. And um, I was going to try and do another one today, but I forgot I have to go. I had to go spend the afternoon with my mother today. So there's no way. And um, so I'm just going to put this one, wrap this up, and get it out to you. If by chance it doesn't get there in time, please just keep it as happy mail. I wrote that in the note. Uh, don't bother sending it back to me. Keep it for yourself, okay? Um, if it gets there in time, sure put it in the swap um so anyway what i used is the doodlebug design cream and sugar collection and i actually used one whole paper pad which was 24 double-sided cardstock sheets and i had two new ones this one still has all but two pages in it and the other one was brand new as well i counted the pages to make sure but it was still sealed so anyway there are 24 double-sided sheets cut up in here. This is the note for the person that normally would go inside, but I was having trouble getting the box to shut right. So I put some little, you know, these things, I forget what they're called, rivets. I don't know if they're on there real good, but, and then just tied the envelope on with um, a ribbon and there, um, their note and some other little goodies uh, cutouts from a, you had a third tablet that I had already um, cut out and some ephemera are in this envelope and now of course I can't get it closed because it's catching on there we go so that is that and I'll put it back together later so I just did the cover with uh, some of the ephemera it says sweets this is like the sweet shop, macaron, some hearts, the coffee pot, the coffee, and a little cookie. And the background has what this is all about. Coffee, tea, sugar, donuts, macarons, iced coffee. Um, I don't even know what else. And also there's a lot of hearts in there. The, this sort of has a sort of a valentine -y theme. I mean, there's a love you a latte saying and um, some heart paper, which you'll see in a minute. And the washi is um, here and here are from Doodlebug, <clears throat> excuse me, from the same collection. So let's open it and see. All right, we had to do six compartments with paper. And so what this is, is four sheets of paper, two of one style, uh, two of another. So two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24 sheets of paper. And I'm gonna just let you look at <clears throat> what's on here to see the papers. This is the one that's on the cover in the background right here. This is one that says, um, actually, I think that one's a cut apart. Then there's a, that's on the, and on what's on the back of that, I guess, is this red. Um, polka dots, no, that's not true. That's all on one. Then there's polka dots. Then this one was a cut apart um, going across lines. You know what, it'd be just easier to show you this way. There's this one, which is a light pink background. And the back is real tiny teal on teal hearts. 
polka dots. <coughs> Excuse me. And this was a cut apart. Red with white hearts. And then this was another cut apart. And these are some of the things that are in their envelope. The coffee's hot and cold to go. Coffee beans. Donuts. And this is just like a, um, I like the sprinkles on a donut. All different color hearts. More cut aparts. Hugs and kisses, sugar and spice, and everything nice. So happy together. We were made for each other. Be mine. I know that's in there. Um, this sweet thing. So some of those are, are in the envelope. Then we have a floral. And on the back is like this pink, um, like graph paper. And then we have the coffee cups or tea cups. And they each have little tiny faces on them. And then here's the one that is the going across lined. Um, and it says, we belong together or love you a latte, sweet as sugar, XOXO, you're my cup of tea, hugs and kisses. And then this one has tiny little multicolor hearts, sort of on a light gray background. Um, and on the back of that is um, like red on red hearts all over. And then this one is a pink with white polka dot. And on the back is a red and it's a tonal stripe and then it repeats you can see it starts over there so there's 12 and 12 and like i said i did take two sheets out of this one um and they were this one here that has real faint pink on pink um it's it's sort of like this one but it's all tonal it's got the coffee mugs and cookies and, and um, coffee beans and things. And on the back is a plaid. And then the other one was donuts. I don't know if I showed that one or not. Yeah, I did. Sprinkles and donuts. So, hmm, that must have been, I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, that is the paper. That is all cut up in here. And each one has... Um, is it four, two, four, two, yeah, four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty, twenty-four, yes. So then, um, I did put my name up here and I also put June 2018 and cream and sugar. This little piece here is hooked on with a flap from Washi and the cover of the doodle bug is here just so they know what it is. And that is stuck on with reusable sticky squares um, and the bottom half of the pa paper pad showing the remaining papers um, is underneath there and they can reuse this. This was one of the papers that I had extra from the other. Um, so then for embellishments, I'll start over here. I have these beads. so. They're teapots and donuts, so they can, whoever can use them. Sorry, that one's falling over, hopefully. That's in that first little compartment. And then over here, I have a combination of wood pieces. There's a flower, it says friends forever, a cupcake, a teapot, and a cup and then some brads which are doodle bug designs i believe i put um, two of each color in and i think they're teacups and and pots so there's purple pink and blue and these are um oops brads I just took the thing out. <laughs> okay. And 
Um, so there's three purple, two pink, I think there's four purple. Nope, four blue, three pink, and three purple. That doesn't sound right. Four pink <laughs> and four purple. Okay, yeah. All right, so four of each color. Um, two cups and two different pots, like. And let me stick this back in here. And put these in. So that's what's in the first little compartments. I'll never be able to get them back in. work okay then over here we had to do ribbon and we had to do um, three colors of ribbon or lace at least 12 inches long and three colors of regular sewing thread um, so what I did is the ribbon and the thread are all in the same compartment there's 15 inches each of this light pink and this darker pink and there's a yard of this brown um, it sort of looked like coffee beans which is why I included it and that's squished in there on a bobbin and then I have light pink a little bit heavier dark brown because it's the only one I had and light blue and those are my three threads and three ribbons then in here I have a bunch of bling Hang on. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to get it out. Anyway, I have some sprinkles type, some coffee drops, some hearts, some blue, some pink hearts, some more of those uh, doodlebug sprinkles. These are sort of cream colored, taupe colored for the coffee. And to go with them, somewhere here, I have two of the to-go wooden coffee cups. I don't know. Oops. Ah, I'm dropping all the bling. I have no idea where that one just went. Shoot. Oh, here it is. Okay. Sorry, guys. Took a while, while to get these all in here, so it might take a while to get them all back in here. Oh, and these little pink sparkly posies, they're called. So lots of bling. And I'm not going to take this out, but um, I had a spool that was almost empty. But it has like, well, I'll take it out. It probably has, it has quite a bit of this pearl strand. Because pearls will go with coffee too, or tea. Or hearts and can I get it back in there we go and then over here this is some sequins they're hearts with arrows through and the green is the word love because like I said some of this is about um, love also in this paper whether it's coffee love or loving someone so um, yeah and over here um, I have lots of buttons and um, flat backs. So we've got a variety of pink, white, purpley hearts and just pretty pink buttons and red and flat back pearls, just a whole bunch of them. Um, and some rounds with texture and yeah some white hearts so all, all different kinds of buttons and flat back uh, white and pink pearls and then let's see over here we have washi samples we were supposed to do at least three and I did four these two are the ones on the outside of the box and they are doodle bug uh, the to-go coffees and the donuts white with red hearts to go with the red um, 
with white hearts paper that looks like that. So I thought that would go good. And some pink with arrows on it. So there are the washi samples. And then over here, um, I have a gold to go cup coffee um, to go cup paper clip. <laughs> And also two um, coffee tea colored tassels. So that's what's in here. And then the last little compartment has some pink um, sticky uh, flatback pearl trim, which I'm not going to take out because it took me a while to roll that up and get it fit in there. So I think that's it. Um, and like I said, the paper's all double-sided. So for example, the coffee cup has um, that one that was striped words. So I'm not going to go through and show them all because I did show them on the top of the, or in the paper pad. And there are just two styles per um, compartment, two sheets for each style. So that would be four sheets in each of six boxes. Okay, so that is my box. I hope that whoever receives it enjoys it. I had a lot of fun making it. It's really <laughs> tight still, which is why I had to tie the card onto the top because it just um, wouldn't close with uh, everything else in there. And I am going to count this. The whole reason I'm filming this is because I'm counting it in my DWPB 100 Things Challenge um, hosted by Rebecca as well. And it will be number 43. So let's write that in. 43 is patchwork embellishment box. for perfectly imperfect crafts cat swap and today is June 17 2018 even though I worked on it um, some quite a bit yesterday was cut up the pieces day and I had hoped to get it in the mail yesterday but I honestly, I had forgotten I had um, my granddaughter Haley's dance recital at two in the afternoon. And so I had to stop it before lunch and have lunch and clean up and go to that. So I really didn't have time to work on it more yesterday. Anyway, that's it, guys. Um, number 43 in my Dances with Pitbulls challenge and cat like i said it'll go in the mail tomorrow morning probably overnighted to you and i hope you enjoyed it everyone have a wonderful day and i'll talk to you the next time bye for now hugs love and peace